So you know, at a, you were, while you were at the Big Ten, you were one of the highly regarded players that you know mm -hmm. able to score pretty good on the defense. And what are a lot of the things that you feel that you may need to work on when coming into the league? Um, I gotta get stronger, and I think that'll come as I as my body matures as I get older, and also being with a, a professional strength and conditioning coach that can really um, get the best out of me. You know, so a lot of teams understand I do need to get stronger, but at the same time they're not looking at that as a reason why they shouldn't um, take me. So um, that's one of the things, and then just refining my skills all together. You know, the game's a lot faster, so um, you just work on my ball handling, consistent shooting, um, going at that at the NBA speed and pace. You know, they play at 24 seconds. And we're used to playing at 35 at college, so the up and down tempo is a lot faster. Do you, think, do you think coming out of the Big Ten gives you any advantages in terms of the level of competition? Oh, yeah, most definitely. My level of competition, the physicality. Um, I think we're the most physical conference in the, in the country. So um, I think all that plays in my favor coming into being a rookie in NBA. And, uh, your dad had a been through this process and mm -hmm. give you any advice? Um, he's let me go through it, you know, just like he did Iowa. He let me go through my, my uh, career at Iowa, and he's let me go through this and letting me learn and um and get through it myself. I'm a man, and um, this is the steps I need to take to uh, progress into becoming a, a professional athlete.